Sweet. What's up guys, it's your boy Dig Dash and I'm back with another video. In this video, I'm going to show you, give you a quick walkthrough of the new Amazon Fire Stick TV. Or Amazon Fire TV Stick as they like to call it, with the Alexa voice remote. At the moment they're on sale in the UK, they're going for £25. In the US a similar amount. I mean, it's a bargain. I mean, it's like 15 quid off or $15 off, however, however you want to look at it. It's an absolute bargain at the moment. I think this is a fantastic device. I think that you need to go get this ASAP whilst it's, whilst it's cheap. You know, we're still on the Black Friday, Cyber Monday kind of weekend. So definitely go get this. This is a goal, this is a win. But yeah, let me just give you a quick overview of why I feel as though this is the bargain of November, should I say. <laughs> Alright, let me just open this up and... um. Show you what it's all about. All right, guys, I've got it open real quick using my um, Rolson Nank. <laughs> Nank's what we call blades in the UK, street, street slang, all of that. But um, let's just quickly open this up. It's very easy to do. Basic instructions, fire that to the side. We also have the obligatory cabling, USB cable, micro USB, good to go. We have an extension for the HDMI, fantastic. If I can get into this, give me a sec guys. The Fire Stick itself. We have the voice control. I'll be honest with you guys. I bought this because I lost the, the remote control for my Amazon Fire TV. Now the remote control, this voice remote control by itself is 20 pounds. Thanks to Black Friday, Cyber Monday. These are going for £25. So it just makes sense to buy the Fire Stick for the remote control. Despite the fact that I know the Fire Stick is a, it's a cool device, all of that. But it just makes sense to just to buy it because it was so cheap. But anyway guys, let's plug it in. I'll do a quick setup for you. What I feel is always the ultimate setup. Something that I do to all of my devices. And you'll be winning. So let me just show you what I do. It won't take too long. Let me just plug this into the, the kids room TV. And um, yeah. I'll be back. God damn I need to turn this light off. Anyway guys. Alright we'll go through the setup process. That's all done. You now we're good to go. So. This, this Amazon Fire Stick 2, Generation 2, is fantastic. I'll tell you why. It's got a quad-core processor. The first generation only had a dual-core core processor. Um, it has a dual-core, sorry, dual-band Wi-Fi. The first one didn't have such a good Wi-Fi chip. It wasn't so powerful. So it's a lot faster. There is no lag. So this is a superb buy for £25. It's cheaper than the friggin... Chromecast and it does so much more because it's an actual Android device. So, as it's an Android device, let's install the application which will change the game. So, here we go. Fire DL, go download that. Where'd it go? Right, so I'm going to download that. Fire DL. Will enable me. Okay, got it. Will enable me to download Terium. Now, Terium is an application that I use across all of my devices, and it's just the most fantastic streaming application. I don't use Kodi anymore. Forget Kodi. Kodi is dead. It's just a headache to do with a headache to sort out. Nowadays, I just stick with Fire DL. Fire DL is the one. Trust me. So, all you need to do is, let me see if I can bring this up. You download this application, of course. Fire DL simplifies downloading stuff simply because you just enter in a code rather than a you know a URL to download applications. So you want to go to their website, just Google Fire DL and make life so much easier. And I can see if I can give you an example of the kind of codes that you have to okay. The kind of codes that you will need if this will load up. So on this shit pad, iPad. Obviously you can't see, but you go to their website, 
by DL. There's a whole list of codes. Obviously, you can't see it. So all you want to download is an application called Terium. So we just type in the numbers. The number is eight, one, five, eight, seven, six. Hit next. I mean, this this is incredibly fast. I mean, I've I've modified so many first generation fire sticks and they've been so slow laggy this is a headache to work with very slow to download stuff very slow to stream very slow to stop it's just a headache an absolute headache i mean this amazon fire stick is comparable to my amazon fire tv which is getting on a bit come to think of it so this might actually be comparable in speed with my fire tv which gives me plenty of food for thought do you change the settings on this no not yet okay where is this gone what I should have done first is go into the settings. So you hold down the home button. Go into the settings. This is very nippy. I might just use this instead of my fire TV. Okay, um go into the settings. What am I doing? Developer options. That's fine. Turn on. Okay, turn that on. I have no idea where. Okay, I have no idea where, let me see if it's, it still has the ABK, it's not actually installed it, has it? No, fair enough, we'll do that again. So fire DL, obligatory ad, you got to pay for this stuff. It's just a headache, we just download it again, I can't, don't always put the APK and I can't be bothered to download a fire manager to dig for, for that APK, wherever it's put it. So, eight. One, five, eight, seven, six. So we download it again for the head of it. And as I said, it downloads pretty damn quickly. Right, let me hit next. I also need to set up the screen as well. It doesn't quite fit. As you can see, it's like slightly zoomed in. That could be just in the settings. I just want to quickly set this up so you can see what's going on, see how I do it. I apologize for the light. <laughs> so here's Terium TV. It should install fairly quickly as well. And it's still installing. Okay. I'll tell you what, let me pause this and we'll go straight to the app. Okay, so let's open the application. It's the first time starting up. Nowadays, Terion comes with a built in video player, which is fantastic. It's a lot better to, to work with than, than VCL, having to download VCL or MX player. The built in player is just fine. So it's already downloaded the latest version. We accept that. We accept what comes with of it. So, this is Terium. So if you want to watch, watch whatever you want to watch. But for example, The Punisher. We've got the seasons. As you can see, it's got a very good, nice UI. It's not like that. Oh, before I get into this, I apologize. Let me go back out and go into the settings. Make life easy. Let's go to the HD like links only. We want the best links. Get rid of the cam. And I think that should be it. Notifications, that's fine. Don't mind notifications. Um choose. Always ask. Choose default navigation. Popular. And I think that would be that be it. So we just quickly check through the settings, see if I missed anything. Playback always ask. Got to need default that. Okay, that's fine. Auto resolve links. Default play action. 
Just play it. Right, let's come out of that. So where was I? If we go back into Punisher, obviously it's very quick as well. It's way quicker than, let's not show that again, okay. So if you want to see episode three, hit the play button. It'll bring up a list of, yep, this is the first time, so all of this is popping up. It's gonna bring up a list of links, eventually. So we can say we go to that one. And as you can see, it's that simple to get up and running. It's that simple. The video quality is excellent. But yes, guys, as I was saying, Amazon Fire TV is the one. Amazon Fire TV stick, sorry. You know, get it on Cyber Monday, buy Cyber Monday. 25 squid buy that it's very cheap as you can see it's well worth it it's such a small amount of money and you get so much out of it a fully fledged fast rapid android tv device if you're not doing this i don't know what you're doing even if you have that old fire stick i recommend you upgrade and get one of these whilst it's cheap i'm gonna throw a link in the description go get that i recommend it thank me later anyway guys peace love please like subscribe you know, let me what you think. Let me know what you think. If you have any other applications that you know of that are similar to this or do things better? Let me know. You know, if you have any suggestions about how I make my videos, sure, go for it. All right, guys, take care. Peace.